Hey, what's up, everyone? Uh, <coughs> Joel here. Uh, it's Monday, Monday mall thing day, so I figured I'd do a open up a homebrew. This is actually the bitter that I made, the English, old English bitter, and I'm gonna try it. It's been ten days in a bottle, and I chilled it a little bit um, today. I'm gonna try it because one of the homebrew people from my homebrew club was sent out an email to the club and I was wondering if anybody had any bitters that they want to donate for a competition that's going on in I think it's Mississippi I think it's called the Mississippi Mash Out or something like that so I'm gonna give them about three bottles of it see if anybody likes it and whoever there's one other guy that's gonna turn one in but if mine wins then they'll ship it out to whoever this competition's at so, this would be my first, like, entry, pretty much. It's, it's for the whole club, but <clears throat> if this one does any good, find out. So, that's my bitter. Um, it's about a 4.4%. So, it's a low alcohol um, beer. It is, if I go to my... BJCP droid beer judge certification certification program and go to bitter um, come on where is it okay, now I lost the category hybrid hybrid paleo Irish English brown porter stout Where's the bitters at? Okay, for some reason I lost the category on where this would be. Smoke flavor, spice, fruit beer, strong ale, Belgium. What the heck? Isn't there a category for bitter? Okay, here we go, it's an English Pale Ale. Okay, so it would be categories under 8A, Standard or Ordinary Bitter, I believe what mine was. <coughs> Let's see, ABV, I don't know about that one. Special Bitter. Mine would probably fall in the category of, yeah, it'd probably be the 8B Special Best or Premium Bitter. So, that's that. Um, I could fall in the category of Extra Special Strong Bitter. Not really strong, though. So, yeah, it'll probably be category 8B, Special Best Premium Bitter. They give that a gravity, or a ABV of 3.8 to 4.6. Mine falls in there. The original gravity, my gravity was 1.050. <coughs> my final gravity was, I believe, one point. Zero one like six, so it's like a four and a half percent here. Um, okay, so that's pretty cool. They have my beer um, judged by the whole group, and then if it passes, then it will be sent off to the competition. Um, I was just making it because I wanted to make a bitter beer. Here we go. It's only 10 days in the bottle. Ooh, that's a good. Yeah, this cap is sucked. But here we go.
not gonna have a lot of carbonation or nothing. I just wanted to taste it. Ten days in the bottle. Whoa. What in the hell? Oh, this is the one that I. I believe those are hops. It's got a lot of kind of carbonation to it. But I'm worried about all this stuff floating. It's not hops. I know I filtered it pretty good, but. There's things like floating in this. What the hell? I have to try a different bottle and see. It's not hops. Yeast? I don't understand that one. Maybe this bottle was like one of the first ones I bottled or one of the last ones I bottled. Other than the look, Tastes pretty good. <clears throat> so, see how that goes. Talk to you guys later. Ah, cheers. Monday malting.